Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for January 25th of 2024 is titled Uvascula in the Sky. So what do we see here? Well, let's take a look at this image of the city here in Finland. And I'll apologize in advance if I horribly mispronounce the name of it. But what we're looking at is an all sky view image. So you can see the entire horizon around the edge here. And the camera was then exposed for not a very long period of time, just one minute looking straight up at the sky. Now we're seeing a number of things there. You can pick out some stars around the uh, in the image and you can certainly see trees and even street lights around the edge of the image as well. However, one of the things all of the pillars that you're seeing there, those lines and streaks of light are not artifacts of the camera, but are actual things in the sky. And in fact, what you're looking at there is the street map of this neighborhood. And that is because we're getting all of these light pillars that will occur when we get the right conditions in Earth's atmosphere. So this was an extremely cold day where temperatures went down to 20 degrees below zero Celsius. And that means there would be a lot of ice crystals in the sky. Well, those ice crystals due to spe specific uh, reflections that can occur can then cause pillars of light going up from each street light. Now here we're looking at the entire area, but each of those lights then going up would then cause this image that we see. So each of those streaks of light represents one street light in the sky. And if you can imagine following them around, you're actually seeing the entire map of this neighborhood that appears in the sky. So various different effects like this do occur because we have an atmosphere. Certain things cannot be seen on objects that do not have an atmosphere. So while it gets far colder on our moon, our moon with no atmosphere would never be able to see an effect like this would not be able to see a light pillar because there's no atmosphere and no ice crystals within that in order to form such an effect. Now other objects may be able to form this if they had the similar light and the crystals positioned correctly. So it's a matter of a combination of having the right conditions that are needed to produce an effect like this and having the ability to be able to capture it as well and record it here in this image on a night when many people would rather not be outside. It's very extremely cold, uh, well below zero temperature that were pre that were present at this time. But here we get to see the street map of this region uh, and as it's formed by the light street lights and those lights being uh, the light from those street lights being scattered off of ice crystals in Earth's atmosphere. So that was our picture of the day for January 25th of 2024. It was titled Uvascula in the Sky. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Star with Planet. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.